Alright. Um. Alright. Let's see, I kind of, uh, adjusted my little camera here. I wanted to make a quick video about, um, the Federal Reserve. Um, obviously there's been all kinds of, um, talk and conspiracies and who knows what about the Federal Reserve, especially after, um, September 11th and all the conspiracy theories and everything that go with that just lead to more um, questions about the Federal Reserve. I'm not a conspiracy theory guy, um, but I am a truth guy. And if any of us are honest, we don't know nearly enough about the Federal Reserve. I've spent, um, I was just back on their website and you can't find the things that you want to know. Um, you can't find the answers to, um, anything regarding the actual printing of money. Um, I mean, I know there's certain things they don't want to tell, of course. They don't want to be like, oh, we print a bunch of money here and this is how much we print. Um, but being that our nation is $17 trillion in debt, and they are the ones that are in charge of the money. Um, despite that the American people and the government have a lot of responsibility, this organization that they claim is part of the government, yet you can watch videos where congressmen look like little children um, afraid in front, that they did something wrong in front of their parents talking to Ben Bernanke. Like they have no idea in like the um, what's behind the Federal Reserve and that they're completely afraid of them, that the Congress is afraid of them. Um, that doesn't seem like part of the government to me. It seems like they're an independent, secretive, clearly secretive, um, clearly independent organization um, that, you know, we should have a lot of serious questions about, um, not just questions, but demand. Um, transparency is not telling people um, what you are willing to tell them. Transparency is telling people what they deserve to know. There's a big difference in that. So just because um, the White House or the Federal Reserve have a website, um, they're only telling you what they're willing to tell you. That's not, you know, conspiracy or, oh, but that's just the truth. They're not telling us what we deserve to know as people, and it's our fault for not demanding that they tell us what we deserve to know. Um, so, yeah, go. I encourage people to go to their website because I hate it when people say, you know, start coming up with stuff before they actually look at what's available. Um, go to the White House website. Be proactive and connect with it and ask questions and they have this whole thing on the White House website where you can um, sign and submit petition and there wasn't a single petition um, to stop the war. I searched everything that you would think of and there wasn't a single petition to end the wars in the Middle East. It's like, okay, so you started this but you're not doing anything to, um, people aren't doing anything, number one. Since day one, it's the people's fault that we haven't um, demanded transparency and tried to do our part um, to connect. We don't. We don't at all. We just have faith and say, oh, uh, they screwed it all up. We're $17 trillion in debt. Well, we let it get $17 trillion in debt. We gave them the power um, to do whatever the universe in the universe they're doing and not um, say anything about it. So, um, hopefully it's something that people not just think about, but um, actually do something about. Uh, Non-violently, not these uh, crazy conspiracy stuff. Let's find out the truth. The only truth is that we don't know enough of the truth that we should know. Um, so, I just wanted to mention that because I just... 
I've been curious about it for a long time and I've visited different websites and asked different questions and it seems that there's only um, certain things that they're willing to tell you that we deserve to know not things that have to be held for you know our safety or you know but things that 100 percent should be right on the website and they're not whether it's um, history of the economy and um, what money in money out and where it went none of that you won't find anything close to that um, we should know a lot more about where our money comes from and where it goes. Alright, um, or their money or whatever you want to call it, you know what I mean? Um, they're the ones who print it, so I guess it's theirs and we're all just on loan. I don't know how that works. Alright, anyway, I have just thoughts in my head.